What's up, everybody? My name is Flare Eternal, and welcome back to Alan Wick. Oh, what was that? Oh, so here we are, trying to. What the heck is? Oh, it's just. The place was dead. Sticks. The ghost town had been for decades, maybe a century. Oh wow! Oh wow! Oh. I knew it! You punk! How dare you! Oh, I see a loot. Yeah, you're done. Okay, I see a note over there. We must grab it. For we have seen it. Oh, come on, Alan. Even I can run longer than you. It's kind of putting me down, ain't it? <laughs> I can definitely run longer than this guy. Well, there's another note. Everywhere these days, huh? <clears throat> so, I believe we're still trying to meet the kidnapper. Given the manuscript pages, get our wife back. You know. Regular Saturday. What would this be? Morning? Evening? Uh, there's stars out, so it is night. Anything behind this corner? No. And runs out of steam. Oh, wow, well, he actually made it. Oh, I don't need batteries, I guess. Is that another manuscript page? I think it is. Now, where's the entrance in here? On the other side, I suppose. called this a ghost town? Doesn't really even look like a town. Just a bunch of barn buildings. Like, what's in here? Yeah, it's just a giant open warehouse. Look at all these batteries. <clears throat> I think they're prepping me for something. What is that? What even is that? There's not even a ladder leading up to its top. What is its purpose? Oh, bro. Oh. Oh. Ow. That explains why they were giving me all the batteries. Nope. Hit that. Okay. No, 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 no. Come on, you're almost done. Alright, come on, possess the tractor. I know you want to. Green called it, bro. Jeez. It's not nice to throw things at people, you know. Right, the tractor's done. We just have this little cart. Well, I think I might go back and grab all those batteries. Can't hit me past that, can ya? <sighs> okay. Um, batteries are back here. Ooh, energetic. Come on, grab the batteries. There we are. Hmm. There was another bunch, but I don't remember where they were, so... Is there back here? Nope. Alright. We'll move on. I think we'll be fine with that. I'm pretty good about managing my battery use. Plus, I think we got that heavy... Yeah, we got the heavy duty flash that. Heavy duty. Ooh, creaky creaky. That's not good. Okay. So... <clears throat> what about this kid damper guy wants? Friggin' weirdo. Oh, that. 
You know, I don't blame that <clears throat> for killing me and like that. I mean, if something threw a piece of train at you, you'd probably be uh, cocked as well. Oh, come the heck on. Ah, you touched me that time, did you? Come on, so close, so close. You're just gonna throw piece after piece of this train? This is a boss fight, ain't it? What sucks is this isn't strong enough to burn it. Up this piece, and then da, 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 da. or not. Hey, I'm all for. Ooh, I see a thermos. Give me that. Anything useful in here? Some keys. Oh man. Are they the keys to the shield? Oh, we finally made it. Looks like there's some appliances on in here. Oh, flare gun ammo. People outside of riding is a struggle. I feel ill. I managed to make my way downstairs. There's a shoebox filled with books and papers by Thomas Zane. It's very hard to focus, but I managed to read some of it. He's a poet, and a good one. He writes of muses and creators summoning fabulous things from a magic lake, using his powers to shape the world of a realm of gods and dreams and demons, dark things that wait for a chance to slip through, wearing the flesh of men as disguise. Zane writes about himself, his girlfriend being taken over by a dark presence, about growing scared of the lake. Zane believes it's a mirror to the gaping void of darkness above, where some Lovecraftian presence lurks. I crawl back upstairs. I'll borrow these things from my story. They ring true. They fit. Ugh. I was just about to say, some Lovecraftian mother humper. Oh, guess it's time to swap guns. Holding E. Holding E. Just give me that rifle. I much prefer the rifle to the shotgun. Even though I had more ammo for the shotgun. Spooky. Let's get a move on. Oh, dang, I'm down to nine batteries. Oh, man. I gotta tell you, it feels really weird aiming at something but not shooting it. Like, using the flashlight to dispel the darkness on those friggin' f everything is throwing at me. Oh. The kidnapper oh, had sent me a text. The message was full of spelling errors and insults. It was telling me to hurry up. Hang on. I gotta grab the good stuff. Can't rush these things, you know? I better not fall down. Alright, let's get the revolver back out. Uh, of all things, why a revolver? Couldn't we have found a nice little semi-auto handgun at the local country store? That would have been much nicer in this situation. Oh, crow boards. Thank you, clever, but you're not. Oh, god damn, I got close. Turn. Come on, dispel them. Oh, you punks. Here we go, it's 
scares me. Dude, can you imagine being attacked by a swarm of crows that just picking the shit? I think I'm safe from you now, though. Of course, I feel like I'm gonna have a different issue down here. Ah, such is life. Get out the rifle. Right, bring it on, you mother hunkers. I'm so not safe down here. Safe from crows? Sure. Safe from the shadow people? <laughs> not so much. Tunnel. Tunnels go to Cauldron Lake. Hey, could you shut up? I'm busy looking around. Oh my god. So, if that's this way. Oh, that's gonna get annoying fast. Well, it says all tunnels lead to Cauldron Lake, so. If that's the case, then maybe it doesn't matter which way I go. Without warning, the headache stabbed at my brain. Oh. Where the hell am I? Okay. I think I was going this way. I'm coming, but my smoker's lungs apparently won't let me run that fast for too long. Ooh. That don't sound good. I'm losing it. I gotta get out of here. Oh. That was death. So this is a dead end then. I see. Well, back the way we came. Sorry, Alan. Do not realize dumping you in that lake water would uh, be insta death. But you could swim, bud. Otherwise, why would you jump in after Alice? You know, I, I hate to be one to assume, but I was expecting. I mean, I guess she you get that she's your wife, but I mean, you couldn't even help her. Why would you jump in, bud? down here? No. Alright, so that was definitely a dead end, but maybe this actually leads somewhere. Ooh, flares. 18 now. I could probably use these a little less sparingly than I have been. Uh oh, there's gonna be something going down here. Look at how they're preparing me. What am I supposed to do about this? Ah! Aim flashlights and- Oh! What the okay, yeah, spawn them right on me, why don't you? God damn! Yeah, just spawn them right on top of me. That's super fun. Ow. What are the flashbangs out? No, get back. Here with y'all sons of bitches. Yeah, he it in the head. Oh my god. That was so dumb, I guess. They were supposed to spawn behind me because I was supposed to be standing right here. But oh my god, just right as the combat starts. Boom, boom! Oh my god. I was in a panic for a second there. Anything up here? Not particularly. Shooting it doesn't do much. So, 
So, anything over here? Oh. I'd have to make my way up this mine shaft in order to go on. Oh, wow. Maybe the machinery could help me with that. Mayhaps. Mayhaps it could. Mayhaps we're about to get ourselves killed. <laughs> How low can it go? There's nothing down there. Just gonna put it right there. Alright. Is that flare gun ammo? What are those? Just little things stabbed in to hold it tight? Must be. Now, we use the machine again. We want to go that way. And then. Who wants to go that way? Yeah, I'm smart. S M R T. the rest of the way. That us. Yep. Boom. Then we hop down. And raise it nice and high. About there. are a lot of control boxes to move something up and down. Though, kudos to the people who made this for their precaution. Seeing the desire or need to move this thing up and down. Still nice and dark out. Kick it, boy! Police! Search warrant! Anyone home? Go up or down? Let's go up. I was gonna say, Alan, you good? You just stopped walking for some reason for me. Oh, more flares. That's useful. We up to 19. Okay, I officially believe the max is 20. Ah, oh, manuscript page. I knew there'd be a reason for coming up here. Apparently I already had that one, but I got a couple new ones while we were trekking in the cave. I don't think I went left the other time I played this. Oh, I don't like y'all. Oh, I hate that noise they make. There he is. Go away. Don't come back. Hate y'all things. Two, three. Butternuts. Oh, great. Another cable car. Just great. Yep, 20. Oh, this will be fun. I bet you I'm going to be shining birds out of the way. Come on, bring on the crows. I know y'all aren't just going to give me a peaceful ride over there. Yep.
I'll just die for me. That one's gone. I'll have to think another one comes and takes its place. Come on, just let me get there in peace. Okay, they're gone. Break the cable. Oh, I'm gonna mess you up. Okay. Oh, jeez. I mean. Oh, God. Dude, I just landed. Give me a moment to rest. But I'm freaking push it. Oh, I am stressed. Whew. This is stressful. <laughs> As horror games tend to be. Oh, man. I think we're good. I like how it drops it and then just sets it down. Gently. But, oh. Alright, thank you guys so much for watching. If you liked it or didn't like it, please let me know. And I'll see you in the next one. Until then, this is Flare Eternal, signing off.